Today I will be, well, well, welcome to Anna's Tube, and today I'm going to be doing an experiment, and remember I did that cold, the soda experiment? Well, I'm going to do another one today, so click down below that there is that video so you can check it out. So, I'm going to pour the dish soap. I'm going to make a video possibly of the milk just explore. So I'm going to pour dish soap in this plate so it'll be easier for the Q-tips to get out. Okay, so I'm adding make these go together. Okay. So now I'm going to add some food coloring. Very pretty, right? You can see how pretty it's going. Okay, now we're going to do yellow. Okay, so we're out of red. We don't have red. So now I'm going to dip the Q-tip into the dish soap. So let's see what's going to happen to the milk. Oh, you saw that? It went like crazy. So now I'm going to get one more and put it in this one. I think the food coloring, I think the blue one, so I see how pretty it turned out really pretty. As soon as you add it, it's like this very pretty combination. I can make swirls with it. You can see how it's moving. Oh, it's making this pretty thing. So yeah, I did the experiment with the dish soap, and I think this was a good one because. It's it the when the food coloring and the dish soap touches the milk, the milk just like exposes. And if you add food coloring, it'll, the if you don't add food coloring, the the milk won't expose and you'll not see the prettiness. But if you do, you can see how the colors just like bloom and make a very pretty color, like this green. So guys, if, if you want some more of my experiments, comment that you like it, and see you next time, bye!